this video I'm going to show you how to use up to three clocks on a LED screen and we're using our STS series which is based on our players 480 LED panels it's 2.4 meters wide by 0.48 meters high consisting of five individual panels now what we're looking at here right at this moment is the computer desktop it's been set to XGA resolution and we've got three clocks there now just to show you the clocks are independent so as I move my mouse over you can see they highlight so they're running as three independent clocks now we've set them up with hot keys so what that means is that we can start and stop each clock individually at our leisure and so I will do that now with the first clock and that's now started to count through. And now at 10 seconds, we started the blue clock. That's keys and also the yellow clock. So we started those, the clocks uh, via their keys independently at that sequence. Now we could be counting up or counting down and we could set any of the clocks to be the actual time of the day as well. For resetting the clocks that's very straightforward as well because we've assigned the start and stop to a hot key on the keypad or the keyboard. So I've now reset the red clock, I can now reset the blue clock and we've now got the yellow clock running. And as I said, these could be counting up or counting down and also displaying the time of the day. Now, the other way of actually capturing data is to use a beam or a trigger and that can be directly integrated into a database where the times can be recorded. Thanks for watching this video. If you found it useful, helpful, and have a need for scoreboard display technology, we look forward to hearing from you. Thanks a lot.